Good morning. The Bank of Canada kept rates unchanged at uh, today's scheduled rate announcement, as expected. The economic recovery has really gone better than they thought to this point. But as we face a second wave, I mean, the outlook is really going to be dependent on what happens from here, or how the virus plays out, I should say. Um, housing has been a big, strong point in Canada's economy. Uh, personally, I've seen a lot of clients that are, you know, migrating from the downtown core to places like Squamish, Vancouver Island, further out in the lower mainland, the interior. Um, if working from home is the new norm, people want to take advantage of that and upgrade for space. Uh, of course, record low interest rates also play a big role in housing. Um, so what does the outlook uh, look like from here? Uh, Bank of Canada doesn't expect to be raising rates until after 2022. So they really want to hit this 2% inflation target. Um, what's going on with inflation? Well, they, they do forecast that it starts to pick up in early next year. Um, that's obviously something we'll, we'll keep a close eye on. Bank of Canada is also continuing on with its, its bond buying program. So I posted a chart in the, in the release below here that really illustrates the significant amount of bond buying that Canada's economy has done. And yes, a lot of central banks are doing this exact same thing, but it illustrates how much above the pack uh, Canada has really gone in the last seven months. Um, basically, buying bonds raises the price of bonds, which keeps or keep supports the price of bonds, which keeps interest rates low. What can happen is if inflation expectations really start to pick up, it can require more bond buying to keep interest rates low. Um, and you can really see how this would turn into a, a vicious cycle. I mean, right now, the, the central bank owns about a third of Canada's debt. Um, so we're basically creating debts and then buying our own debt. Um, that cannot end well for a currency and for the cost of goods. But again, this is something that we, we love to keep a close eye on for and, and we'll keep you in the loop. But thanks for watching and please let me know if you have any questions. Ciao.